Hey there, Leo. Welcome to your reading for the week of November 7th. Uh, this week, make sure to check out astrojar.com right here for more awesome YouTube readers and people like that. Having said that, let's see what is going on for you uh, this week. I'm using a brand new deck for you, so I definitely want to make sure that it has a good shuffle on it. But let's see here what's coming up for you. Uh, a lot of opportunities and things like that. Uh, pay attention to paperwork and things that you do involving paperwork and contracts. But, yeah, it looks like an interesting week for sure. And also watch um, watch uh, overdoing it as well with things. Um, watch your reactions is what I'm getting. I'm actually going to start here. Uh, you have the Eight of Spades. It came up at the end, and uh, the message came in very clear. This is a card of overdoing it, overdoing things, like usually like working too much and uh, you know needing a break and things like that. It's actually not a bad or a good card. It's just like a card that says, you know, make sure that you take a very balanced approach uh, to things this week that you do. Um, you know, so um, but the message that came in is that make sure you uh, kind of watch your maybe your personality um, this week. You, you know, you could be um, with people and you you might overdo it like with you know like talking or, or whatever so make sure to just watch out for that i'm also getting that if you are involved in sales or anything like that that you should um really pay attention to your talking this week and make sure that uh you know the other side is allowed to talk more than you um and, and things like that especially if you're involved in sales again um it's a message that's coming in so i'm going to deliver it might be important to somebody out there if you're involved in sales um but just allow the other side to talk more might, even if you're not involved in sales it might be a good week for you to try to um maybe listen a little bit more and and, and not talk too much i'm getting that you could overdo it this week like i said weird message but it's coming in Next, you have the Nine of Diamonds. Great card of opportunities and new opportunities coming in for you. I actually think that there's a ton of opportunities for Leo, especially doing new things. You've heard me say it probably like a hundred times, and I and, and I apologize, but I'm going to keep saying it. Um, you know, if you're one of those Leos who is not seeing improvements in your life, you need to try something new. You need to do something different. Get a you know get a new job, start a new career, or something along those lines. Um, because I think that uh, Leos who are stuck are stuck because maybe they're not doing the right thing and, and they're just, um, you know, b possibly um, basing what they're doing off of like money or fear and things like that of, of lack of lacking money and things like that. But again, I think the Leos who, who kind of move on to doing things that they truly enjoy are going to be the ones that are very successful. And you have a ton of opportunities to do that as well with this Nine of Diamonds. It's all about doing things that you enjoy, doing things that you love, um, and that you actually want to do. Uh, Nine of Diamonds is also the card of newness just in general. So like, you know, a lot of you Leos could just be experiencing new things happen happening. Also a card of dealing with inheritances, uh, and anything involving like large checks. Um, but also if you're involved in something legal like that, um, like if you're involved in, um, you know, uh, inheritance, uh, arbitration or you're involved in, uh, like divorce or anything like that, make sure to double check all your paperwork. Uh, you have the three of diamonds, just a card of problems with paperwork. And it, it's a card that asks you to double check your paperwork so that nothing happens. Um, and, uh, you know, like I said, so just, Double check everything that you do this week. Double check all paperwork. Go back over paperwork and things like that. You never know what you could find. And again, this card is actually beneficial to us. Like if we do go and double check our paperwork and things, we could find something that's very beneficial to us or that, you know, protects us from something or that actually helps us out. So definitely do that if you're involved in anything legal. And again, if you're struggling, this is a card. It is the card of doing something new, trying something different. Uh, next, you have the Ten of Spades. A Ten of Spades is a card that, like I say, it's, it's um, you know, I don't read this as a bad card or a good card either. It can be a card of definitely like um, some disappointments and carrying a burden. And it can also represent a fear of change. Um, I think that for most of you Leos, that's what it represents is like a fear of change and a fear of new circumstances and things. I think that for a lot of you, actually putting yourself in new circumstances more frequent, frequently will help you overcome those that, that fear of change and things like that. Um, so like stepping outside your comfort zone and things will uh, kind of help you um, kind of develop a stronger 
stronger kind of resistance or whatever you want to call it to change or not resistance but like you'll just get used to change more by um kind of like practicing it if that makes sense um and uh yeah i think that's what this card really kind of wants this week next you have the fool upright very good card of starting new things so again a lot of you could be starting new things and a lot of you could actually uh, not the uh the typical meaning of this card but i'm also getting that this week that a lot of you could be called on for your knowledge this week in, in certain ways like a lot of you could be asked to consult or you know uh, kind of um you know maybe brought in at work or something like that for some a little bit of extra knowledge and that could be very beneficial to you as well that could literally send you in a totally new direction um, you know, and I think that for most of you, it's regarding work. Um, and even if you're retired, some of you could be called back for something, um, you know, could be called in for help or something like that could give you a nice little check or something like that as well could be a little bit of extra. Um, but uh, yeah, it is a great card of starting new things in general. And then finally, you have the two of clubs. Uh, two of clubs is a card of again, built uh motivating yourself this comes up a lot for you leo i think um it's a card of building that fire inside of yourself i say and kind of keeping yourself motivated so definitely stay motivated this week uh, it still looks like a good week even with those two challenge cards there i still think you know um it still looks really nice for you and, and like i said nine of diamonds could be a big check or something like that coming in as well so thank you for watching and enjoy your week